good morning you guys welcome back to the channel hope you all are doing awesome just got dressed ready to go get my toes done i gotta go this will be the last day before the little one takes her summer break to where i can go get my nails and toes done without anybody disturbing me my phone is going off so i'm going to do that today it's going to be her last day before summer break i let her go to school the last day simply because it's a half day and it's like what's the purpose or as i don't do half days i really don't um and i feel like some of the teachers could appreciate it. some of the kids stay home too but summer break is here for us here in arizona um and i'm trying to figure out what i'm going to do for her I don't know you guys i've been trying to get some things some ideas but i'm gonna tell y'all we're gonna play it safe we still in the middle of a pandemic and we're gonna just just gonna go with the flow just let it pan out not try to do too much um this is my otd just in case any of you guys is wondering i got this little um woven hat on that i bought like yeah around christmas time I don't know if I'm aware today, y'all. It might get to a little hot. I got my little graphic tee. These shorts, I could not fit. I have bought them, and they were super tight, and the girl can finally fit them. I got them from Target. I don't know. I want to say last summertime, but they are finally fitting. So that's what I'm going to wear. And I just might wear some um, cognac sandals that I actually got from Target a while back as well um, to kind of match my belt but if I take the hat off I can still you know yeah just try to figure out what's gonna happen with my my little my little hairdo because I'm trying to grow the top part and stuff out but yes I literally I have to mentally and physically prepare myself for the little one being home for the summer even though I have one but y'all that have multiple halo halo by herself who <laughs> would have all y'all kids be trust me some places some states require for you to be fully vaccinated in order to come there and you guys know how i feel about it i'm just not doing it now this is no way shape or form to encourage people not to get the shot i'm just saying what's gonna work i feel best for me i'm just sorry and i don't care to be traveling like that anyway um so i'm good I'm good. I, I can have fun in my own backyard. I'll stay home. I'm a homebody anyway, so it does not matter to me. But at the same time, I still got to figure out to keep my little one entertained for the summertime so she doesn't drive me to the nut house. Seriously. Okay, y'all. I am back at the house. Um, I've been back for a while now. We ain't got my toes done. Kind of upset because i went to a different place the last place i went to <clears throat> i've been going there for years but they kind of rubbed me the wrong way when i went to go get my feet done the last time um i was the first person that was there and they put me in a seat right to get my feet done so i'm sitting a girl come in and a guy come in laying there the girl wanted to get her nails done and the guy wanted his feet his feet done he wanted a pedicure so i'm still sitting in a chair but the two other ladies went to the other two people so i was like oh no and i had to let myself look here let me tell you something i said y'all know i was here first in line these two don't have appointments they walked in just like i did y'all don't want to do my feet you just lost my business so anyway i'm not going back to the air but i did try a new place because i will always see how they get um a lot of customers and so i figured i'll go today since this is going to be my last day for me to have just my own time. <laughs> Halo is going to be home and it's like, what am I going to do? Y'all seriously, I'm like, what am I going to do? But do what I would normally do when I, any other day. But So I just wanted to have that peace and quiet. But I went in there, got my toes done. But I'm upset because you know how you tell them, they'll ask you, well, do you want your toenails cut? And I had a little crack on one of my on my big toe and i was like yeah but very very little and then i walk out with like little nubs like it just makes me mad that's why i rather for that's why i prefer for them just to file my nails as opposed to cutting because they just 
get a little bit too happy but anyway they did do a good job i will definitely go back there to them um i'm just gonna let them know too don't cut my feet don't cut my toenails i'm trying to figure out like i said y'all what i'm gonna do for this girl for the summer i've been getting stuff hold on let me turn the light on so you guys can see i've been ordering stuff amazon here and there um, I did go to Target. This is the first thing that I got for her. Because like I said, we're going to be doing a whole lot of stuff. Just entertaining her at the house. <laughs> so I got this got this water slide. It's a two-lane watermelon water slide with built-in sprinklers. A couple of weeks ago, they had this on sale for $15 or something like that. So I had picked it up for Halo. Let's give her something to do, right? Because Arizona gets so hot. I've seen this now they have these actually on sale this week I believe it's like 15% off what is this name like Coogee Coogee I don't know I don't know but anyway it's these unicorn pop modes so I think that would be nice and something cute and fun for us to do because Hato loves to get in the kitchen and with this you can use uh, fresh puree juice um, yogurt pudding so this would be a good way to do like a a healthier um and y'all can see the fruit is on here a healthier way of a popsicle as well as a little sugary one and speaking of sugary one i got this too i ordered this i will link everything down in the description box i would definitely try to but this nostalgia uh retro snow cone maker once again it's hot in arizona and halo we always want ice cream so i have had this for about i want to say a week and every day since i got it we've been having ices yes halo's been loving it um it works really really well you guys it shaves the ice just like icy and like old school you think about water sprinklers and icy that was just like so much fun you know or well back in my day we would have like the um man come in the car and they would scrape the ice and you have that big old block of ice and they'll scrape and you have a slushy and it just be most the sugariest drink or whatever but it was so good um i also picked up these syrup flavors one is in pina colada here now i got this for me because mommy gonna be having an icy too and then i also got it in, and these are from target as well you guys this one here is in um, a cotton candy they have some other flavors but i just picked up those two to try them out i don't recommend these these are watered down like i don't know if y'all can see it but really watered down so i would just um i'm gonna keep them of course because we used them then i picked up the snow cone cups these were at target and it comes with a straw 20 come in a pack so um i got that they also have a um snow cone maker at target currently right now this week which is the 26th of may for i think it's 15 percent off you guys look i i i, I I don't know when I'm gonna upload this video, but I'm just letting y'all know, just in case. I also went over to Five and Below, I wanna say a week or two ago, I wanna say, or last week. And I got this little water gun pack and I got her a little rocket launcher. Just trying to find things, different stuff to keep her busy, like I said, outside in the house. If you guys wanna see the snow cone, she is so cute. Like I said, excuse the kitchen. Um, it is what it is but that's what it looked like um, it does really really good it has really great reviews on amazon like i said i will link it down below and it uh shades the ice pretty well so i just leave it out only thing i recommend is that if you get this when you get done with your um crushing up your ice is to flip it over shake it out and then flip it over make sure all the water come out of there or dry out because otherwise you will still have ice in there, not water, but ice. So you'll still have ice in there, which eventually will turn into water and can sit and rush your blade. So definitely turn it over. I can't talk. I showed you guys those two slushy syrups. Like I said, it wasn't great, the greatest soul. Then the next day I had went out and I picked up some bottles myself. These plastic bottles here 
from Walmart. I think they like 94 cents or 96 cents either way. No more than a dollar. Got a few of those and I got some Kool-Aid packages. I'm going to show you guys how we make our little um, snow cone syrup and this is what I've been doing. So good. It just reminds me of my childhood. This one is a lemon raspberry lemon line and I made this one yesterday morning. So, but anyway, uh, we're going to make two more, uh, but Halo wants to make them with me. So she's going to do the purple and the pink so she can have her a slushy. So I will definitely share that with you guys. Hey, you guys. So just to add on to the other video, I wanted to quickly share with you all my pre-summer grocery haul trying to stock up for the summertime we went grocery shopping this is going to be a stock up grocery haul um just filling in a lot of different stuff y'all know it's just really me and halo here that i'm cooking for that we could use because i plan on doing a lot of grilling this year you guys know i've been loving my grill so i plan on doing a whole lot of just throwing food out on the grill vegetables as well as meat <laughs> so I got a good deal on some chicken. Chicken is real scarce this year. I don't know why, but it's scared, hard to find, as well as it's high. And so my sounds club, this was just an impulse buy this morning. I actually went in there just to get toilet tissue because to stock up on that, being that it's the summertime and my child is home and I go through toilet tissue quite a lot. When she have a small little behind, it doesn't make sense, but y'all know how it is. <laughs> so... Went in there for that, but I got a deal on some meat, so I'm gonna share that all with you all. Like I said, it's just me stocking up for the summer. Okay, it is what it is, and don't mind the stain on my shirt. This just happened from the raspberries that I picked up from her. But enough rambling, let me just share with you guys what I purchased. I went to Sam's Club as well as Walmart, and then I got my car washed, of course, and I had the little one help me, so. This is, a, this is the part of the summertime when the kids are home that I can appreciate. <laughs> so, but you guys, my food haul and everything that I got for as far as stocking up for the summer. To start off, I got these cherry tomatoes. I'm gonna be making a pasta salad, so I needed some of those, so I got that. From Walmart, I picked up some mint because I want to do like a lot of juice, natural juices, so I picked me up some mint for that. I got a cucumber for my pasta salad, some sweet, what is this here? Sweet kiwi fruit, once again, natural fruit juices, water juices here, just some watermelon slices, some peach rings, something for just a snack on. I got some raspberries for the little one. I picked up some chamoy to do like risottos. If you guys know about risottos, if you don't know, you better get up on it, but to make my own. <laughs> Halo picked this up high choose, but this will be for both of us since I paid for it. So this is a really, really good, sweet treat. I think it's like a Japanese candy, but it's really good. Packed with flavor. Absolutely love it. I got some ocean spray, grape, and cranberry juice, and then the apple and cranberry as well drink. Some slim simply orange juice for breakfast in the morning. Some mango nectar. For a uh, Respato, I got this Arvindale Red and Buckers um, popcorn butter oil. I did also get a popcorn machine too for um, us to have in the summertime. I got these tamarindo. This is like Mexican candy that you put in your Respatos if you like it. You know, you know what Respatos is. You know what that is. So I got that. Some Werther's original. I put this in my little candy dish by my entry door. Sweetest fish for Halo. We got some Mountain Dew Major Melon. Um, I picked this up for me. It looked at just, I don't know, summery. Because it's uh, Mountain Dew. And then it's watermelon. You know? So, anyway. Some Sprite and some Pepsi back there. Here is the popcorn. So, we can put in the popcorn machine. I will show y'all that in a minute. Some French onion dip. Bob's Big Boy Blue Cheese. My favorite. I got two packages of bacon, like I said, and this is the thick 
cut slice a lot of um grilling for that so got that jimmy dean's my great grandfather's favorite and it's also my favorite sausage to have some mini pepperonis because actually i'm going to be putting this in pasta salad y'all can see there it says for um there we go for salads pasta so i'm going to be putting that in there i seen this and i thought it was pretty delicious handmade crab cakes wild caught crab meat so i think i might have this for lunch today you guys six come in the pack um it looked delicious so y'all know how i love my seafood speaking of seafood i got this colossal there was oh how much what i have to get my receipt but i think this was 12 dollars for the pack you know grilling the large ones i like to use for like a grilling I got Halo some more chicken nuggets. These are just like the um, Chick-fil-A nuggets, you all. I got these at Sam's Club. They are really, really good. I think Walmart has like a smaller bag of them too, but I wanted to just stock up on that because I also, like last week or a week or two ago, I purchased the Chick-fil-A sauce at Walmart. A good deal on their baby back ribs. You get four in a pack. It was like... 41 bucks um isn't it four i think it's four in here yeah i think i see four but anyway a nice size medium nice size meaty ribs so y'all know these gonna be definitely going on the grill for sure uh here i got some sour cream i got this toilet tissue this tissue is a dupe of i want to say like Charmin, you guys if you guys see this at sam's club it is nice soft it lasts a long time I love this. Don't buy the box stuff. <sighs> yeah. This here is a really nice uh, bath tissue. Got some Lay salt and vinegar. My favorite as well as Halo's. Some Ruffles original. Some smart popcorn for when I want to snack at night. This is what's the chicken that I bought. Yes, baby. You too. I got some chicken thighs. Y'all see that price? A $5.82. Yeah. This is like a big, large family pack. So I got one... A funny story is I seen a couple the lady had a basket and then the man had like those little that long basket for boxes and stuff I don't know what you call it but anyway he was loaded up on these and I'm like what's going on it's a chicken y'all know they black and I'm like y'all ain't buying all that chicken for your store are you because the lady had a basket and he had the little the flat cart went over there the chicken was 92 cents a pound as y'all can see yeah, 92 cents a pound, so stocked up. So I got not one, but two. This one was 631. Y'all see that backwards. And then I got some um drum mats, which I really don't buy, but once again it was a good deal. This one here was was 534. So what I'm gonna do with these, I really don't care for drumsticks, but I will put these like on a grill. So it'll give you a little bit more meat. If you know my child, she every look, she won't. She's in a mood to where she don't want to go nowhere. She don't get no takis, takis on the weekend. So I got this. She had a 48 box, but I was like, no, let's downsize a little bit. So we got this for her. I plan on letting this last the whole summer. That was the deal, but I know that's not gonna happen with my child. I got two more things of water. 40 bottles come in a pack. These are two dollars in 93 cents or 98 cents, y'all. Good deal. Yeah, for 40. And then I also purchased me a deep fryer. My deep fryer had went out on me. So I needed another one for like when I be wanting to fry chicken and all of that good stuff. The little one is over there eating. I don't know what she's eating. Some little corn chips, Mexican corn chips. She loved those too little grocery haul i'm gonna put this stuff up bag it up separate it and bag up what i can i don't know how i'm gonna get this stuff in here but i was just like it was a too good of a deal to leave okay my freezer is already jam packed as y'all can see but i'm gonna uh, maneuver this one thing my mama taught me is how to pack some stuff i right, getting this stuff packed broken down first wash broken down packed up and put in the freezer for um a rainy day another day because the little one is home and she gotta eat food we gotta eat so i'm getting started on all of that 
So I just took the crab cakes out the oven. This is what they are looking like. I'm gonna let them sit and cool a little bit before I indulge in them. And I will let you guys know how they taste. I also forgot quickly, you guys. This is also the popcorn machine that I ordered. Um, I haven't tried it out yet, so I don't know how well it works, but once we do crack it open, I will let you guys know. The reason why I got this because we just like fresh popcorn. I will sometimes do it on the stove, but it seems to me like all of the microwave popcorn hasn't been tasting all that great. So I said, let's just give this a try. We like to snack on popcorn. Let me take it out the box so y'all can see what it looks like. This cute little little thing here um really cute that's all we need i didn't want nothing big just something simple it'll just the more you add the popcorn the, the corn the more popcorn you can pop i don't need no big cheese big old machine not for like no entertaining purposes like i said this is perfect for just at home entertaining Thing, you know movie nights so that's the one this is what I got you guys so I'll let, once again I'll let y'all know how it does when we finally decide to crack it open maybe I might do it this weekend or so oh this is all the other stuff it comes you can get so I'll let you guys know how um, like I said it works 